So we want arches yep, I feel through that. very squatted knees. Yep. Good, and pre-deploy. Yep. Excellent. So are you miles away again? Yep. Miles away. Now. I hung back on that. Well, you had no choice. What? So, so, so let me get my next tool here. So are we doing driver? Yes. This is and how are we doing with the driver? Um, not so great. Not so great. Come, come on over. Come on over. So I'm just, uh, I'm... So, this is, I, and I really love doing this drill right here. Everything feels like it can hang under your shoulders, right? So it's easier to use the weight of the arm club unit when you're dealing with wedges, short irons. And then as the clubs get longer with the hybrids, the hands and arms start getting a little further away from the body. So if I had a short club, it's going to turn vertically. See, I'm, I'm imitating my knee-high drop right now. So if I had a much longer club from here, well, how do I get this? I have to stand further away from it. And now you can see that that's going to turn a lot more diagonally. So driver is a lot more over here. So what you need to do is you set up your ball in a string first. See where it's passing? Then you bring that with your tee. So if I wanted to get it high, doesn't that look like I'm going to catch the tip of the tee much more on the way up from here? Lower. Very low. Now I'm going to Ireland. I'm going to play, you know, Bally Bunyan really, really low. So I want to keep that out of this four club wind. I'm going to, I'm going to, sweep nice and low and, and hit it out there and am I in the right country, Bally Bunyan, by the yeah, way? Yeah, we just said Trulie's a better course than True, Bally okay, Bunyan. good. <laughs> and when you got two Irishmen going, bzz, 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 I'm going, man, maybe I said something wrong here. <laughs> so if I want to decapitate that tree, there's my intermediate point. This feels like my ball in a string is going to swing down and through the tip of the tee. And now I can get that ball coming out nice and low. So you notice it just barely skirted the top of the tree and drew back toward the other tree. If I want it to go a little higher, see the difference? So now over here, it feels like I'm going to catch it a lot more on the upswing. So now I'm staying with that. Now I'm starting to get a little more height out of it. Well, what about this? This is great practice. So right now you can see, am I still in the frame, Sav? So you can see that there is going to go clean underneath that ball. Ah, look at that. I can see the blur. See why it's important to see that blur? So where is this block going, by the way? Where is it aimed? The red post? Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to go a little fade. So that feels like I'm catching it slightly on the way up and to the left of that red post. So you see, that was nutted right in the center of that club face. I made a prediction. I said, if I let it ride around the arc, it feels like the tip of the T is in the way of that swing. And you notice how I was able to catch it no problem. So what happens, if you tee the ball high and you set up and then you default to the ball. Here we go. Ball. Pop fly, big pull left, big slice right, you name it. So we really have to stay with that arc in the direction of that intermediate point. So you're predicting, hey, there's my arc. My arc fits that intermediate point. Perfect. So if I go from here, yeah, that feels like the tip of the T is in the way of getting struck by the sole of the club. So all I'm trying to do is clip the tip of the T from here 
and that ball is going to meet the center of the club face. Make sense? All right, let's give it a go. So do a couple of practice swings first and let's see where the blur of the club passes. All right. Do a couple more. Bend the knees, yeah. Make a nice arc. Good, stay right there. So it's passing on this line here, isn't it? Okay. Did you see that? No. Nope. You didn't see the blur? That time. Do it again. Observe the blur. You see yeah, it now? Yeah. All right, stay right there. Wasn't that where it passed? Yep. Okay, so eyes on the T, let it blur through the tip of the T. Okay. There you go. How'd that feel? Good. Wasn't that the flight you're looking for? Yeah. No, no, no complaints. Good. Just felt like I was miles away and I was sitting on the ground. And, and notice you just <laughs> nicked the tip of the T and was that in the center of the face? Pretty much. Pretty much, huh? Wasn't much missing there. So can you can you predict where the blur of the club's gonna pass? Yeah. Do you see it? Yeah. Good, good. So put the club down on that line and bring bring the arc over to the tip of the T. Now, if you let it track its arc, isn't it gonna clip the T? Yep. Good, let it. There you go. Ooh, yeah. Very good. That's a great miss. Right? From here. <laughs> From he, here. He feels like this over the ball, right? You're going to look at that and you're going to go, I can't believe it. It's yeah. such a distorted thing, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, because it looks like you're standing. <clears throat> and that's why, I'm you know. You, I feel like this. Listen, that's I mean, it. You had me straight up. And there's there's proof that we suck at body part positioning because yeah. you think you're doing something entirely different. So when I say set up like a power lifter, that that would be the flavor of it, right? Yeah. Perfect. Let's see one more. So a nice power lifting setup. Observe where the blur passes. That's it. So you see it's a wonderful arc, isn't it? More power lifting in the knees there. Good. Let the blur go through the T. Good miss. Now were your eyes on the T or on the ball? Oh, I was kind of looking at the track to the path. Just trying okay. to make sure when I saw the white blur coming to follow that track. Okay, so well, it's going to follow the track because the center of the machine's here. Okay. So if you just you, you just throw it into, into the arc, it's going to track. Okay. So you just want to predict that the track is intersecting the tip of the T. Okay. Okay. So there's no making sure about the track. You're just yeah. letting it track through the T. Yes. Awesome. Look at that. Well done. Great demonstration, man. Awesome.